In this product guide, we're going to show you the numerous products from Green Shoots. Green Shoots offers a range of products built for the precision application of herbicides. All of our units dispense foam. This includes the small foam herbicide dispenser shown at left, the large foam herbicide dispenser shown in the middle, and the precision electronic dispenser shown with the backpack on the right. Foam is the ultimate in precision, visibility, and effectiveness. This slide shows a precision application to a cut stump of a Canada thistle. Here you see an application to a bull thistle rosette. And as you can see, even a small dab of foam is devastatingly effective. Here you have a tangled mass of crown vetch in a planting bed. For any of you who have dealt with crown vetch, it's very difficult to kill, especially when it's in amongst desirable plants. One way you can deal with crown vetch is to do a bent stem application where the stem is bent near where it enters the ground and foam is applied to that bent stem. And a short time later, you'll see the crown vetch is completely killed with no re-sprouts and no harm to the other nearby desirable plants. Foam herbicide works excellent for cut stump applications. As shown here, foam is being applied to the cambium of a buckthorn stump and is shown at right. About a year later, you have a complete kill with no re-sprouts from the stump. Here's a foam herbicide wipe onto Canada thistle. A small amount of the Canada thistle foliage is covered with the foam. Nonetheless, you get a complete kill. The same is shown here with south thistle. A complete kill with a small amount of foam herbicide wiped on the foliage. Finally, here's a foam herbicide wipe to the foliage of a woody plant, a small maple volunteer near a foundation. As you can see, again, the results are very effective. With all of these herbicide wipes, you only need a small amount of foam herbicide covering approximately 10 to 30% of the foliage to have great results. Here's a photo of me using the precision electronic dispenser to do a herbicide wipe on a Canada thistle rosette. We're using the mesh brush in this case to brush the foam onto the thistle rosette. The great thing about the precision electronic dispenser is that you don't have to stoop. The applications can be very fast and there will be no off target harm. This photo shows the large foam herbicide dispenser being used to apply foam herbicide to Canada thistle rosettes. And here again, the mesh brush is being used. Here, the large herbicide dispenser is being used to make a foliar application to Japanese knotweed that had been knocked down uh, earlier. Foam works great for foliar applications. Just like the wiping applications, you only need to cover about 10 to 30 percent of the foliage to have great results. The precision electronic dispenser can also be converted to dispense ultra low pressure spray. What's the advantage of ultra low pressure spray? We conducted indoor tests comparing the spray pattern at different pressures. We did these under controlled conditions. They were done indoors, so there's no wind involved. We sprayed white paper with colored water at a specified height. And we did this at different pressures. For example, this illustration shows the spray pattern at 30 PSI. As you can see, the shadow spray pattern, the pink part of the illustration, was 2.5 times the size of the specified spray pattern. That's the spray pattern that's specified in the nozzle manufacturer's guide. Compare that with the spray pattern at 10 PSI using the exact same nozzle. 
Here the shadow spray pattern was less than 1.3 times the size of the specified spray pattern. What this shows is that ultra low pressure tightens the sp spray pattern. This means you'll get less off target harm with lower pressure. And the surprising thing is that spray coverage is just as good at ultra low pressure. These two photos show spray of common buckthorn with a glyphosate and a non-ionic surfactant. The coverage in those two photos is virtually indistinguishable, even though the, cover, the spray at left was done at 10 PSI and the one at right done at 30 PSI. That's it. Please click on one of the links provided here to visit our website and look further at our products, or you can view one of our other videos. And please subscribe to our channel to see more of our great videos from Green Shoots.